Well, my experience, actually, uh, when it comes to the studio, uh, <laughs> uh, we had tried to work with the studio in England, and um, we re we quickly realized that it was a bad idea because they didn't understand our style and. While they were a very good studio, they understood music and they did their best, but they completely misrepresented uh, the music uh, because we wanted it. We wanted it to be uh, reverent music. We wanted it to reflect Christ, and that was severely missing. So we decided um, uh, to work with uh, Gaitha Studios. And I remember when I started, when I was talking to, to Jero and uh, right then and then I realized um, uh, that he was the right person to work on our album because he was very understanding and he understood things uh, that I explained to them uh, when I was trying to give him a picture of what we were looking for in the album. And he actually took it further. He even, you know, started uh, giving me tips and stuff that I realized that actually he's... The, the best person to work with us. And the studio experience was amazing. Uh, first of all, uh, being at Gaither Studios, you know, a lot of legend mus gospel musicians have been through that studio. And it was amazing to be in a place where you know that uh, most of your favorite singers have been uh, or uh, have recorded their albums at. So it was a blessing for us. But the team that Jero put together to work on our uh, instrumentations and to work on our album was amazing. They were very professional and they knew what to do. And <laughs> it was amazing. So like for us, it was overwhelming, but it was very good for us. It was a very good experience. And uh, when it comes to you know, the mixing and, and all that was taken care of by Chad, who is also who is a, a senior engineer at Gaitha Studios. And he's done a lot of big projects as well uh, for, Gaith, for the Gaitha Vocal Band and many other groups. And it was amazing working with him because he already knew where we were going and what we were trying to do. And so we didn't really have to explain much because he already knew. And for us, that was a big blessing. When you're working with a lot of studios that don't understand your style, it tends to get really hard to explain to people what you're trying to do. But again, you know, we, we, we had so many experiences. It was really cold and, you know, waking up in the morning and there was this amazing family that hosted us and, you know, uh, and they took care of us and we had, you know, amazing breakfast there like breakfasts like every time before we go we we'll have like a full meal in the morning so that really encouraged us and we were able to to do what we needed to do while we were at the studio and god bless you and um we invite you to we want you to be at uh, the release it's gonna be again it's gonna be uh, july 14th at camelback seventh day adventist church at 6 30 p.m